Hi, my name is Raymond Jones. I'm a nuclear medicine technologist for Baycare Outpatient Imaging. I've been doing this over 20 years, and yes, patients can be nervous. I've seen it quite a bit, but I can typically make them feel more comfortable and get them through the scan. It's a pretty easy scan, actually. Uh, before we scan the patient, they have to sit for one hour, and we have a special room for that. In there, we can turn the lights down, they can, which can help them relax. We also have TV, they can listen to music, or we have magazines and books. Uh, when the patient goes in for the scan itself, we lay them on the table and we get them positioned. Once the scan starts, they'll go in and out of the scanner a few times. Uh, that's for the CT portion. The PET scan takes about 20 minutes. All they have to do is just lay there and relax and hold still. So after the scan is finished, uh, we allow the patient to leave. There's no restrictions. Uh, they're able to eat, drink, anything that they care to. Uh, then I process the images and get them prepped for the physician to interpret. And once the physician interprets that, the report goes to the ordering physicians or any other physicians that the patient would like. The ordering physician will typically get the report within 24 to 48 hours, if not sooner. We have many patients that return here simply because we make them so comfortable uh, we are efficient at what we do uh, because a lot of the patients have a difficult time with their veins from all the procedures that they've had done prior to this. So because we've been doing this so long, we're very efficient. We can make them as comfortable as possible. This job allows me to feel good about helping people. Uh, I worked in a hospital about 25 years ago as part time to save money for school and did some side work for the nuclear medicine department, saw it, thought it was very interesting and said, that's what I wanna be when I grow up. Well, it allows me to image patients uh, in such a way that is different than the anatomical imaging such as MRI, CAT scan, X-rays. Uh, we can see stuff on a molecular level, whereas the others cannot.